erotica, romance. you in a trance Erotica Today, I'm going to show you another celebrity-inspired look. Today's celebrity is Madonna, one of my longest-running idols ever. I love that woman. And today, I'm going to attempt to recreate a erotica look. And today's look is going to be created using only Avon Cosmetics. And I'm going to start off by priming my face. And I'm using my Avon Magic's Face Perfector. into the skin you then want to move on to your next step which is to apply foundation and I'm going to be using my Avon Ideal Flawless Mousse Foundation as you can see I'm very pale so I like to use the shade Ivory Joined today with two guests. I have Fred up here and Rita down here. Um, so I'm going to attempt to conceal those now using my Avon Color Trend Concealer in Fair. I think it's Fair. No, it's Light. Sorry, my mistake. I need to go back to Spec Savers. So I'm just going to dab that over the top and then just pat it. Pushing your fingertip. Do the same with Rita. And now I'm just going to set that with some face powder and I'm using my Avon Color Trend powder in translucence. This face powder is um, oil controlled so it's perfect for those of you that have greasy skin. Instantly mattifies it. Now that the face is done, I can now move on to the eye makeup and I'm going to start off by priming my eyes and I'm using Avon's eyeshadow primer and I'm just going to take a small amount on my fingertip like that and then I'm going to apply this to the old eye area making sure you blend it up to underneath the brow bone 
Right, I am now going to apply a light beige eyeshadow to the old eye area over the base. I'm going to be using this um, 8 on 1 eyeshadow palette that Avon used to do. It's called Neutral Tones. And it looks like that. <laughs> For the next step, I'm going to take a dark brown eyeshadow. I'm going to apply that to the eyelid and then, then blend it very well into the crease line. I'm using another 8 in 1 eyeshadow palette. This one's called Smoky Eyes. And the brown I shall be using is this one here. take an even darker brown eyeshadow and I'm going to apply that to the eyelid and then bring the colour underneath the lower lash line. This time I'm using uh, my Avon limited edition little red dress eyeshadow palette in Hollywood. I also have the other one in Starlet which will also be getting used and we don't sell these anymore. Um, but the brown eyeshadow I'm going to be using is this one here at the bottom. I was going to be using my other little red dress eyeshadow palette, this one's Starlet. And the reason being is because I'm going to be using the black eyeshadow at the top to fill my eyebrows in with. However, to save on time, I'm not going to record that bit, so I will be back once the brows are done. I'm now going to line the upper and lower lash lines and the waterline with a black eye line and I'm using Avon's brand spankingly new always on point eyeliner. This is witchcraft. Okay, to finish off the eyes, I'm now going to apply a black mascara very heavily to my eyelashes. And I'm going to be using my mysterious mascara from Avon. This is coming out in Rocha 10. Give it up, give it up, give it up. Ok, 
Okay, so now the eyes are done, we can move on to the rest of the face. I'm now going to contour my cheekbones just to give a more defined look to my face. And I'm going to use my Avon Colour Trend Blusher in Terracotta. It's a nice soft brown, so it would be perfect for my skin tone. As I said, it's just to contour and define the cheekbone area, just to give it more of a, I don't know, make it stand out more. It also helps to slim down your face as well. I'm just sweep it underneath my jawline as well. Up towards the temples. To add a bit more colour to the face, I'm just going to sweep a medium pink blusher over my cheekbones. This is Avon's Ideal Luminous Highlighter and it's uh, revitalised. But it's such a gorgeous pink that I, I, I like to use it as a blusher. Sweep that up my cheekbone area. Okay, I'm now going to finish off the look by applying a lipstick to my lips. Now, this is where I get confused with Madonna's look. Now, back in the 90s, she was so famous for a, a bold red lips. Um... But in this, her lips are more of a, a nude colour. Um, so I've decided to use my Avon Ultra Colour Rich Rubies Lipstick in Noble Nudes. Which looks like that. It's a very nice nude colour. It's got a hint of pinky red to it. I'm just going to apply that straight from the bullet. goes on so easily and there we have it that's my recreation of madonna's erotica look i hope you have enjoyed watching this as usual i shall put pictures of me um at the end of the video so you can a closer look of what i've actually done um in my opinion this look would probably be ideal for anyone who's going to maybe a, a costume party or going out triple treating or I don't know, but at the same time, it's a really nice, sophisticated look as well that you could wear every day. And the good thing about it, it's from Avon. So what so, more could you really ask for, eh? Anyway, thanks again for watching. Do take care of yourselves. If there's anything you would like me to do, please let me know. And uh, that's it. Until I see you again, it's bye for now. She's flying She's flying She's flying Yeah, do as I say Give it up and let me have my way. I'll give you love, I'll teach you my clock. I'll give you love, I'll teach you how to give it up. Do as I say. Give it up and let me have my way. I'll give you love, I'll teach you my clock. I'll give you love, I'll teach you how to. Oh.